Hey, what's up? This is IndigoMusic.com. I'm Rohit and it's yet another edition of Experience Sessions. And joining me right now is Zubin from the band Indiscreet. Zubin, welcome to IndigoMusic.com. Hey, Rohit. Thanks for having me here. Happy to be here. Well, it's our pleasure, Zubin. Now, let's talk about Indiscreet. Uh, I mean, I, I'm pretty sure people know about the band already, but how did the band form? What is the journey? And, uh, you know, what kind of music do you guys perform? Okay, you're going to need about two hours for me to narrate the whole story but I'm sure we don't have that much time so let me just start very quickly we started the band way back in 1984 it was known as Rock Machine in those days right and we toured and played I think for about uh, eight or nine years under that name um, in about 92 when things were going well for us we had uh, a couple of videos out on MTV etc we had also signed on with a British manager and uh, his opinion was that, you know, the name Rock Machine really sucked. Yeah. Uh, he felt it was like a more sort of college band kind of thing. And we were really trying to push and go international. And we had plans. Uh, we went to Los Angeles to record our fourth album, third album. And at that point of time, we decided to change the name. So that's when Indiscreet was born. And yeah, it's been pretty much that way till about 97 or 98. I think we stopped playing. We took a 10-year break and we came back in about 2010, 2011. I'm very bad with dates, so this is yeah. possibly like one or two years up or down. Yes. So that's the way it's been. And as far as the material goes, it's always been original uh, contemporary rock. I mean, we have four albums out and the sound has changed obviously over the years. Yeah. But uh, I think each album had a distinctive sound and a sort of style of its own. Right. Now, Zubin, personally for you, would you prefer your first band name or do you think Indiscreet is, uh, what, what is ah, your opinion? Okay. Good question. I think uh, I think Indiscreet is a way better name because uh, there's a funny story why it was called Rock Machine actually. For the first show, uh, the actual name, we used to listen to a band, uh, an artist called Rick Emmett, I think, and he had a, an album called The Rock and Roll Machine, which we used to really like listening to. Right. And then somebody wanted to organize the very first show we were doing. And he said, what's the name of the band? So we said, okay, the rock and roll machine is what the band is called. And then when he printed the poster and he came back, it just said rock machine. <laughs> so we said, hey, it was supposed to be the rock and roll machine. He said, yeah, but it didn't fit on the poster. Right. <laughs> the poster was too small. So they just decided to change it to rock machine. So that was how rock machine was born. And we went ahead with that name. In those days, it was okay. But I think... Uh, once we started, you know, playing internationally, recording internationally, Indiscreet was far more reflective of our roots, of where we came from. Uh, keeping in mind that we were not a sort of traditional Indian band, we were still an Indian band playing contemporary Western rock. Right, right. Fantastic. Now, a big event, Sunday Soul Sante, happening this Sunday. Uh, and of yep. course, Indiscreet is uh, headlining the gig. What can people yep. expect from Indiscreet? And how's your association been with Sunday Soul Sunday? So, actually, this is the first time we are playing there and we're very excited. We're very happy that Karan's invited us to play this gig. Right. I've seen he sent me some YouTube clips and stuff. So, it looks like a very, very cool event. And Bangalore has always been one of our most favorite hunting grounds. We've had fabulous audiences uh, every time we've played in Bangalore. And we haven't done a gig there for quite, uh, quite a while now. So, we're really looking forward to performing there. And... What can you expect? Well, a very high energy rock performance, as always is the case when Indiscreet performs. Yes, absolutely. And uh, looking forward to this uh, performance because the whole team of Indigo is going to be there at uh, Sunday Soul Santa as well. We'll catch up there. And it was great talking to you, Zubin. Have a great Super. day and see you at Thank Sunday you, Soul Sunday. Thank you, YouTube. Cheers. Thanks, Roy. Right. Bye bye.